Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Dear viewers, today we will discuss about damper for building structures. Then we will model fluid viscous damper in e terms and we will show the difference in result or the effect of damper in building structures. So let's start. Definition Damper systems are designed and manufactured to protect structural integrities, control and prevent structural damages by absorbing seismic energy and reducing deformations in the structure. Seismic dampers assist structure to resist severe input of energy and reduce harmful deflections, forces and acceleration to structures and occupants. There are several types of seismic dampers. Here we can see the types lead rubber bearing LRP damper or base isolator, friction dampers, PVD, penguin vibration damper, pole friction damper, metallic dampers, lead injection damper, LED, shape memory alloy, SMA, tuned mass damper, TMD, fluid viscous damper, FVD. We will model fluid viscous damper in ETAPS. What is fluid viscous damper FBD? In this damper, by using viscous fluid inside a cylinder, energy is dissipated. Due to ease of installation, adaptability and coordination with other members also, diversity in, the, in their sizes, viscous dampers have many applications in designing and retrofitting. There are different type of FVD. One is this. This one is another type and this one another type. Main theme of this viscous fluid viscous damper is inside the cylinder there will be fluid which will dissipate the seismic energy during the earthquake. In video we can see here we can see the fluid viscous damper. You can see the liquid this type of dampers we can see in vehicles in their wheels in structure in this way like bracing these dampers are installed now we can check different types of fvd and their capacity in table here you can see fvd with different capacities force in kilonewton here force and their weight or mass in kg and here is the assignment procedure for FBT link in ETABS. For example, uh, we will provide FBT having capacity of 500 kilonewton, this one 500 kilonewton, which is having 98 kg mass. Here we will provide input 98 kg as mass and weight weight as force 500 kilonewton and link type damper exponential here directional properties u1 will be fixed this u1 is the acceleration directed to the bracing direction that means along the length of the damper so let's see this model without damper we will run the analysis and we will check the story displacement maximum story displacement and we will write here the displacement value after finishing that one with fvd we will check again story displacement and we will write the value here then we will compare after the comparison we will understand the effect of fvd now run the analysis after the analysis we can check story response plot maximum history displacement for qx maximum 3.52 inch 
q x 3.52 inch and q y 3.07 Zero seven inch. Okay. Now close this one. This one unlock. File save as. We'll rename it with damper. Now we will model damper here from here elevation first we will see the grid system a k 6 and 1 we will use to provide our damper view a go to define section properties to define damper this link or support properties add new property here fvd 500 type damper exponential here we will provide mass in kg and weight or force in kilonewton so i will choose here unit metric si default then def define linker support this one we can modify fvd 500 exponential here in the chart we can see this force 500 kilonewton that means this one 500 and mass 98 kg 98 and acceleration fixed in u1 direction okay now click on okay now here we will draw our damper from here we can draw draw link or from this side also we can draw link here property fvd so from here to here here we can see this is in this direction if we draw like this then it will be reverse which is not practical so we will draw up to down now go to another elevation a k replicate this link also three F roof already done two F like this okay this side we can see plan Now here, grid 1 and 6. One.
Đấy. Rồi. Now go to elevation. Six. these two link replicate history now this elevation k also from here to here this one replicate history apply now elevation a one side we missed this one from here to here now this one select history apply done now we can see our damper in model now we will run the analysis and we will check the maximum history displacement run the analysis after the analysis, we will go to display history response plot here. Go to QX 53.84 millimeter. If I change the unit to check in inch, we can see this is 2.11 or 2.12 here qx 2.12 qy now qy maximum 2.76 so here we can see after providing this damper we have got maximum history displacement less than without providing damper so this was our discussion I, I hope you have got an important idea about effect of dampers in building structures and how we can model fluid viscous damper in ETAPS so thanks for watching, stay tuned for more important tutorials. Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update.